Well, if it wasn't for what I do, you probably would have no idea that even Sanders and the family even existed today. For what we did, who we are, what we do, you know, you want to know any of it. Eight years ago, Kentucky Fried Chicken came out with ads that upset my family, and I saw how much it upset them, and as I learned more about my uncle and who he was, it upset me to see them portray him that way, but I also thank them for doing that, because now I'm doing what I'm doing, and I actually like KFC now, in case people are confused on that, we made up a couple years ago. Would we be Kentucky Colonels without me being on the internet talking about this stuff? Yeah, you just want to know about it. Um, most of my family have kept to themselves after Uncle Harley died. Not many were public. Cousin Lee was the last real public person in the family, in the public eye. He started Lee's Famous Recipe. He had a restaurant called Pops Fried Chicken and Catfish. He had a restaurant called Katie's. He was friends with Ray Danner that founded Shoney's. That's actually who he sold Lee's to. And he was in the public eye doing interviews talking about Uncle Harley and his experiences and family stories like what I'm doing now. And I believe he died in 2002. After that, no one in my family has really been public. We had a few people like Joe Lettington come out and start spreading lies. And that also prompted me to get on the internet and start talking about the truth and what I knew and what I could find out. So far, I'm the only one in the family showing interest in what Uncle Harley did as a professional choice.